Hi friends, it is Chelsea aka Hungry Hungry Hippo and welcome back. Today I'm going to be filming the week of, what was this, December 27th through January the 2nd of 2022 in my new Aura Estelle Cloud A5 wide with the Sadie's stickers inserts. So I had filmed a, um, a you know, a planner kit lineup video for January and February and also for March. And of course, you know, as is my luck, the, uh, the footage somehow like got corrupted or something disappeared. And needless to say, I don't, I don't have the planner kit lineups for January, February or March. So you guys are just going to get to see these videos as I give them to you. And, uh, yeah, I apologize. So, I am going to be laying down the day-to-day -day stickers for this week in January. And then I'm actually going to show you guys the 3rd through the 9th of January as well. Because I kind of went a little crazy and planned it off camera. So, I'll show you that too. But we are going to get started. So, this is the kit that I'm using for this particular week which was the um, uh, Cheers printable kit from Planner Pixie Co which I had used originally in the um, in my uh, Avalon and Ninth planner as well um, and I paired it with some gold like a little foil wiggle from Scribble Prints Co it's the gold star wiggle I think it turned out really, really pretty. I did put the deco across the side. You guys will see I did that in quite a few spreads, especially for the beginning of this year. I'm trying to show you guys the... that helped a little bit, yeah. And then I did use this overlay from Scribble Prints Co. that said the, says the year is yours. But this is the base, and we'll go ahead and zoom in and start on the day by day. Okay, so we are back. I'm going to go ahead and just lay down this spread. I'm going to sit down. And okay, so we're going to start with a little flag from the kit. And I'm going to use this in combination with this gold foiled icon. It came from the wiggle that I used to mark that I had a video go live. I just kind of chose to not write anything in there. I apologize. This is not wanting to come off of the, my little pre-planning pages. There it goes. Good gracious. Next, I'm marking that I did some laundry. So the scripts I use this week are from Kinsey's Creations, and then this icon is from Kinsey as well. Or not from Kinsey, it's from The Wiggle. And then I also got some happy mail on this day. Let me, actually I have no idea what I got. So there is that, and this icon is also from Kinsey. Or from, oh my gosh, from um, the, the Wiggle. My gosh. I also had to make a Dollar Tree run, this little circle kit, circle. Um, I tried to use as much of the icons from the Wiggle as I could, so you'll see a lot of those. And then I also did the dishes and, or I cooked dinner and did the dishes. And these two are not gonna fit in here, are they? Hmm, <laughs> not really, oh well. I have chosen not to do the half cut headers with this kit because, oh my god, that is such, that is such a nightmare. I did add in some of the little star decoration bits to some of the, um, uh, the little stickers that I chose to use, so you guys will see those. Moving on to Tuesday, first thing I'm going to mark is work. Oh. Um... I didn't write down where any of these stickers are from. Shit, I think that cooking character is from Sweet Tea Plans. And then this work script is from Purple Bunny Prints and the bow is from the kit. I did have to pack my lunch. So the pack, 
the lunch box is from Thule, Thule Digitals or something like that. And then the script is from Sweet Avis Paper. And then I also got some happy mail on this day. Again, I have no idea what I got, but the icon is from The Wiggle. That is crooked again. And then we also had family dinner, and the script is from Kinsey's Creations. That is a custom. I do remember that. These are old. I don't. I know she she's uh, reopened her shop or is reopening her shop. I just I don't know any of the details of it, so don't come after me. I don't know. And the heart is of course from the Wiggle. Moving on to Wednesday. First thing I'm marking is work again with the script from Purple Bunny Prince and the bow from the kit, or from the wiggle. Packed my lunch again. I'm going to move that work label down. Same way I marked both of those again. And then I did have some more happy mail on this day, which again, no clue what I got. And Icon is from the kit, or from the Wiggle, and then I also did wash my hair on this night, and this, again, Icon is from the Wiggle. Moving on to the second half of the day, or the week, rather, we will, uh, I'll move this out of the way, so it's not, like, in the way. Um, okay. So, work again. Got a or I had a coffee I don't know I probably like got it coffee script is from Kinsey's creations I think it was a coffee Monday script um but I cut off the Monday part and then the arrow is from the kit and then this coffee cup this iced coffee is from the um foil wiggle Probably got coffee. I probably just like made myself coffee. Did was that even in frame? Oh my goodness. Anyway, did not have much to mark. So I wonder, do I have any deco left from this kit? I doubt it. Oh, I do have some deco left. Okay, okay. Let's pull some of this in. Oh my god, I just ripped. Oh, dang it. I was going to keep that. I guess not. Should I lay it down? I guess I could. Oh my god, I can't believe that just <sighs> ripped the weekend banner right off of the sheet. That bums me out a little bit. <sighs> there it is. There it is. In all of its glory. Moving back over here. The only thing else that I had to mark was I had to buy stamps for the baby shower invitations. My sister-in-law's baby shower. Okay, let's see here. Let's let's use will this fit. It will if I move everything. I didn't have that much to mark on this day. It was New Year's Eve. I didn't or the New Year's Eve Eve, I guess. I didn't really have that much to do. I just went to work, had some coffee, called for a prescription refill. Called it a day, I guess. Bought stamps, but I, I know that I didn't go to the post office and buy the stamps because by the time I get home from work, the post office is closed. So, there. How's that look? Again, could you even see that? I don't know. I'm going to stand up so that I am above the, um, uh, above the planner page that's so that I can see if I'm in frame. Okay, payday. Script is from the kit or from the wiggle. Uh, arrow is from the kit and the money symbol is from the wiggle as well. Of course, I did some online shopping. Gosh dang it, I did it again. Uh, why do I keep doing this to myself? Like why? Like where in my brain did I think that I could fit a basically two half boxes on top of each other. Anyways, money icon is from the kit or from the wiggle. Oh my god. Get gas and oil change. It was a car day. 
actually good and check these off. Both of these, or this is from Kinsey's Creations. This is from The Wiggle Oil Change. And then I got some more Happy Mail on this day. Don't ask me what I got because I don't remember. And I can't look it up. I could, but I can't be bothered. Happy New Year! Woo woo woo! I picked up way too much stuff to put in this box. That's cool. Oh my god. Really? That looks ridiculous. Chelsea, why did you think that would fit? All of those icons are from the Wiggle. I know that looks ridiculous. I guess I could put... Okay, yeah, we're going to do this. Picked up KFC, did some editing, script from Kinsey's Creations, and then talked to my friend on the phone. All of these icons, again, are from the Wiggle. Moving on to Sunday. So I ended up having to um, use one of these little half box foldables. So I had a, an appointment to get a vaccine for work. Script and icon are both from the Wiggle. Uh, these checklist squares are from the kit and the money icon is from the Wiggle. I had to go to Dollar Tree and Michael's and then we did some online shopping. Icon again is from the Wiggle. So put that like that. And then I did film on this day. I don't know what I filmed. I'm assuming a plane with me or something. And then I also had to cut and print kits and also invitations for the baby shower that I threw my sister-in-law. And then cooked dinner and did the dishes. Both of those scripts are from Kinsey's Creations and the icon is from The Wiggle. All right, my friends, here is the finished spread. Nice and shiny and gold. I really like it. I love blue and gold together. I think it's such a wonderful combination. I do love bl blue and silver together, but I feel like for a New Year's spread, you kind of have to go gold. So let me show you everything that's left in both the kit and the wiggle. I will be saving what I can to use later. These kits are pretty big, so they come with a ton of stuff. This is another foldable. And then the wiggle. Let me pull it out of the... Pull it out of the cello for you, so you can see. Like I said, I may go through later and add in some of these half-cut headers, but I just, I hate to do it on camera. So, all of these are used up except for the half-cut headers, as well as a couple of the full box overlays. I did use the half cut headers on the sidebar. Forgot about that. So added a little sparkle to the sidebar. Um, oh, I pulled these from Scribble Prints Co. So these corners were just like from a foil grab bag that I had gotten. And then I think I probably, I can't remember if this was in the wiggle or not. I feel like it was, but I don't remember and then I did that Wiggle also included these really pretty stars. So let me, I'm going to show you my spread for the uh, 3rd through the 9th really fast. Because like I said, I did, I did go ahead and plan it on off camera. So it was just like a really simple spread. I used a kit from Nightingale Paper Co. It was her Limitless kit, which was a uh, her anniversary sale kit from like three years ago, I think. Um, but this is what it looked like. I'll give you a close up of the spread. Um, not a lot happened this week, I will say. Um, I'm pretty happy with how it turned out, I'm not going to lie, but yeah, I uh, did not really like, I didn't plan it on camera, so um, I just kind of wanted to do my own thing and not have to worry about getting the camera out, and honestly, this kit was way different than I was like 
that I'm used way different than I'm used to. So honestly, it was just way easier to do it on off camera. And I think it turned out really good. So anyways, let me flip back over to this. Thank you all so very much for watching. And until I see you next time, bye-bye.